Prime Minister Narendra Modi addressed the Indian diaspora in Australia. He said that India is the world's biggest talent factory. He thanked Prime Minister Anthony Albanese for renaming the Sydney suburb of Harris Park as Little India. Anthony Albanese praised Prime Minister Modi and said that the relations between India and Australia are ever more deepening. In a stunning turn of events, shares of Gujarat-based Adani Group firms continue to rise with the group's flagship Adani Enterprises, climbing nearly 19%, almost four months after being hit with allegations of fraud by a US-based short seller. An SC-appointed panel found no evidence of stock price manipulation. Meanwhile, a SEBI probe into alleged violation of money flows from offshore entities has drawn a blank. The group has crossed a combined market valuation of Rs 10 lakh crores. In a significant development, the Rouse Avenue Court in Delhi has extended AAP leader Manish Sisodia's judicial custody till June 1st. The former deputy CM of Delhi was arrested on February this year in connection with the alleged corruption in the now scrapped liquor excise policy. ED has accused him of generating proceeds worth Rs 622 crores through the activities as excise minister. In a remarkable achievement, the Indian Navy successfully carried out an engagement of a sea-skimming supersonic target using its latest indigenous guided missile destroyer INS Murmugao. The milestone highlights the Navy's combat readiness and commitment towards Atmanirbhar Bharat. Named after the historic port city of Goa, the ship can be regarded as one of the most potent warships to have been constructed in India. The NIA has arrested Dinesh Gope, a self-styled leader belonging to a Maoist outfit. The arrest was made in Nepal where Gope used to run a dhaba for over a year, posing as a Sikh man to hide his identity. In February last year, there was an encounter that took place in Jharkhand between the People's Liberation Front of India led by Gope and security forces. It was after this incident that he escaped to Nepal. The border security force deployed in the Indo-Pak border of Amritsar brought down a suspected Pakistani drone. Notably, this is the fifth drone that has been shot down by the BSF in the last four days. Upon further investigation, the troops found black color DJI Matrice, 300 RTK quadcopter and 2.1 kg of suspected heroin. 